video. I hope you're all doing okay. I have wanted to try alcohol inks for quite a while now and I ended up finally ordering some the other day and they have just arrived. So I wanted to do a little video of me showing you basically how to use them and where I got them from. Just like a little tutorial of me going through the colours that I've got and different sort of looks that they give you. So I have got them here. I ended up getting them from Amazon. So I will get into it and show you how to use them. So basically, I have wanted to try um, alcohol inks for quite a while, but I've never really known where was best to get them. Um, now, I did put a little question box on my Instagram and just sort of said, can anyone recommend anywhere, you know, that they get their alcohol inks from? And um, there weren't really very many suggestions flying around. So I sort of took it on myself and I just went on Amazon and typed in um, alcohol inks. So this was a set that came up. Um, I know that people use alcohol inks for loads of different things other than nails. So I needed one that was obviously in sort of like um, a gel, you know, like with a brush in it for um, applying it because some of them do just come in like the bottles with um, like just a, a lid, that, like a dye sort of thing, if that makes any sense. Um, so yeah, I saw this one and I thought I'll give it a go. I'll put a little screenshot of it in the corner. I think it was around 13, 14 pound for these six. So this is what arrived. Um, so this is the front and the back. So I'll just open them and show you what's inside. So here are the six colours. Um, the, there is gold, um, azure, don't really know what colour that is. Um, yellow, fuchsia, lead and green. You can't really tell the colours that much um, in the bottles because they are quite dark. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically just get some swatch sticks and I'm going to just give them a base of white and then use them on the white base so that you can see the colour um, on there and basically just I'll show you how to use them and everything. They're really easy to use. Um, and yeah, just give a bit of um, a review on them. So I know um, obviously you can use these on their own or you can mix them to sort of like get a, a multicolored sort of vibe, whatever you know set you're creating. But yeah, so these are the bottles. Um, so what I'll do now is I will just go over with a white gel polish on some swatch sticks just to get the bases ready. So there's all my swatches done. I'm just gonna put those under the lamp now for 30 seconds. So while they're setting, I'm just gonna get my bottles out ready. Right, so these are all set now. So the first one I'm gonna try is the gold one. So this is, I'll just show you what it looks like. It's like, because it's ink, it's really sort of like watery. It's not like a gel polish. Um, so I don't know whether you can see that in there, how sort of like watery it is. You'll be able to tell when I put it on the swatch stick. So what you, all you literally have to do is obviously this gel has been set. So just take small amounts, drop it on the nail and it literally blooms. So this is more of like an orange though rather than a gold but it's so weird to watch so all literally all you do is just dip in and dab on and you can see it uh, blooming
Do you know what? I actually think this looks like um, the bubble effect. You know, like when people do uh, put bubbles on the nails and then it leaves that look behind. It reminds me a bit of that. So there is, it says gold, but it's very much orange in my opinion. <laughs> so that's the first one. The second one we're going to do is azure. And again, I'm just going to dab that on. Oh my god, I love this colour. This colour is so nice. So there is the blue one. And the next one I'm going to do is yellow. I'm only doing them on a white base um, just so that you can see the colours in this set. But you don't even have to use like a white base, you'd be able to do um like a colored base and do this on top depending on like obviously which colors you were going for you can always add in as well like if you feel as though there's patches that you want to go over you can just sort of like add it in and change it if you just go over it it'll just bloom again into a different sort of position so there we go that's the yellow one the next I've got is fuchsia this looks so nice Oh my god how nice is that pink oh my god <laughs> sorry but why did i not get these sooner <laughs> So there is the pink one. Next one I've got is lead. Um, it is like a grey. Oh my god, I'm obsessed. I feel like these bottles would last you so long as well because you you literally don't need a lot and then the last one I've got is green so let me just show you this one oh my god this is the perfect green to do like crock print I haven't actually done any crock print nails yet but I wanted to um to do some for a while it's like the perfect shade of green how nice is that so that is all of them so let me just get them back um, but yeah so that's all of the colors and um, obviously once they are dry um, you can just go over them with the top coat or add anything else that you wanted to add into it. But yeah, they're really, really easy to use. Um, so I would definitely recommend them for the price because for six, it was like £13 or something. So definitely good to have um, to get creative, especially if you've got clients that want to try new things. 
um, because I think you could create some really nice sets with this. So there you go guys, I hope you found that helpful and I would, like I say, definitely recommend them. But as per usual, if you have any comments or questions, then just drop them in the comments and I will come back to you. And yeah, make sure you follow me on my Instagram and TikTok, it's at The Nail Room by G and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! <laughs>